Hello everyone and welcome to another review of Crafty Crafty. This is the Evolution Ridge B 185mm circular saw. And there's not a lot I can say about this saw really uh, in terms of, of specs and everything. It's 185mm blade, it cuts at 45 degrees and it's got you can alter the depth on it. I've owned this saw about four years. And so far, it's been absolutely brilliant. This saw has, it's done loads of work. It's done roof rafters, it's done flat roofs with 8 four, eight before ply boards on it. It's laid floor, floor after floor after floor. Um, solid oak countertops, um, it's cut them. Beach countertops, it's cut them. Um, and everything in between. 3x2, 2x2, 4x1, 6x1, it's just, it's just been brilliant, it's been one of the best saws I've ever bought. Um, I've cut through nails with it, with no problem, I've cut through 3mm aluminium, no problem, uh, the blade, um, I've just changed this blade about 2 or 3 weeks ago, uh, I think I paid about £16 for a new blade. Um, but the blade that was previously on it lasted four years and it grafted, it proper did graft. It's been a, it's been absolutely brilliant. So as usual guys, um, I always put links in the description below and um, the affiliate links. Um, if you, you're looking at buying a new circular saw and this has been one of your things you were thinking of buying, you will not go wrong with this saw. Uh, the affiliate links I put in the bottom doesn't cost you anything extra to buy it. I obviously do get a kickback off that link um, and I always try to find you the cheapest possible deal that you can you can get um, and I, when I bought this saw I can't remember what I paid for it to be honest it's been that long ago um, but it's got the, the chain guard on it which is a good to me previous circular saw uh, the, the blade guard snapped you know when you were going up on again a bit of wood so you had to manually do it by with your thumb um <clears throat> this one's never snagged ever it's got the vent on the side here and um, so you can plug a vac into it to collect your dust uh, on the back on the back of it it's got a button here which locks the blade so if you need to change the blade um it's just a simple allen key undo that tap it out and it, it's a 10 minute process to change the blade, it's absolutely brilliant. You've got your depth guard, your depth guard button is here at the back. Undo that, and the depth guard goes up or down. Um, I'm not sure what the depth is, but I'll measure for you before the end of the review, so you know. But it's, a, it's smooth, there's, there's, there's not a lot of play in it really. Um, and it, it's just nip it back up and it's good to go it's got a 45 degree on the front here oh it's been that long since I've used that um, it'll do 45 degrees and when you're cutting at your 45 degree you have a mark here you have two marks one for zero when you're cutting at a 90 and one for 45 degree line that up that inside one up with your mark and that's your 45 degree cut right through your wood um, it's it, overall it's just a short review overall i just wanted to review the saw because it's been an absolutely brilliant saw and as usual i'll only review i only review tools i've used and rated um if someone out there thinks they've got a better saw by all means send it to me and i'll i'll put it out on jobs and i'll give you a review about a month or six weeks later when it's done some graft um the saw itself it's not a soft start saw when you pull the trigger it's that's it it's bang it's, it's on up to full speed um but it's been great as you can see it's rotten um it's proper dirty off the jobs and stuff but the the, the saw itself has been faultless it's, it's just brilliant it's got about the cable on it is about six foot six foot in length um and it's it's plenty enough we use flexible extension if we need any more very seldom we do um, I've even had it upside down and wedged in a bench and used it as a table saw even though I have a table saw we were out on site and we needed one so 
we had one of the the workbenches reduced that adjusts so we just turned it upside down wedged it in put the guard back fired it up and used it as a, a temporary table saw and it worked great for that as well now this i can't i can't fault these evolution rage b 185 millimeter saws uh, it's been good to me it's it just continue continues to work uh, it's got a new blade in it now it's like a hot knife through but them blades are brilliant if all you were cutting was wood all the time and you weren't cutting anything to take the blade off that blade it, it, it just lasts forever um, it's only because we've we've cut metal with it we've gone through nails with it um, <clears throat> generally abuse the saw uh, it comes with a guide uh, that goes through here and onto there we've lost ours um, so obviously if you want to cut a two inch bit of wood straight down you can just put the guide on and run it all the way down um, I've used it on um, track saw rails and everything and it, it's it's just been really good it's it's just an all out top saw it's it's been a really good saw I can't endorse this saw enough uh, hats off to evolution um, for making these saws um, I've, I've, I have a saw bench uh, a table saw sorry um, at the moment which isn't an evolution one um, but as soon as I get time I'm going to buy one of the evolution ridge table saws because the spec on them and the reviews I've seen are, are, it's a proper awesome table saw it's got everything we need for the job <coughs> um, these saws they're, they're not that heavy there's a fair bit of weight to it but they're not overly heavy like you can use it with one hand and and stuff i would say maybe a couple of kilograms a couple and a bit um apart from that it's been really good so i'm just going to nip and get a tape and um, just give me two seconds i'll be back and i'll get a tape measure and we'll measure the depth of the cut for you um and then at least you know what it'll cut if you're thinking of buying one two seconds and i'll get the tape Okay, I'm back. So we have the tape, a crappy little tape. I give my wife it because she was forever bugging us for the tape. Um, so I've seen that one and I give it it so she's got her own little tape kicking about. So the depth of the cut is, I have to put a tea towel on the table. So if the wife knew I was doing these reviews, she'd kill us. Um, the depth of the cut is about two and a half inch. Um, on the cut so I mean we've cut um, 9b3 timber on it and all we done was flipped it over and then recut the other side and it was a it was a nice clean cut and that was on on a big decking job uh, the decking was raised off we didn't want to use crappy timber on the the underneath so we used c16 9b3 timbers um, and it was this short done it all it cut every bit of wood uh, there's not nothing on that job that we we used um any other so far this was the go-to um it's been dropped it's been kicked it's been through in temper um and it, it's it hasn't broke it hasn't bent it hasn't done anything it's been a really good saw guys so if this is if you're thinking of buying the evolution rage b 185 millimeter circular saw you'll not go wrong with purchasing one of these and if you're thinking of purchasing one of these guys, look in the description below and there'll be an affiliate link in there. As I, like I say, you won't pay any extra. Uh, if anything, you'll get it cheaper than what you'd normally get it because uh, I'll, I'll find the best deal for you. When I bought this saw, it was classed as um, like a returns, uh, manufacturer refurbished. Um, and I was a bit weary about that at first, um, but they were unfounded unfounded wood is really because this saw has just been faultless absolutely faultless so i hope this review helps you out in your decision to buy a new circular saw and um, if it does and you like the review um, please smash the like button and the subscribe button um, it helps the channel out a lot so i can keep bringing you reviews i've still a lot more reviews to do um, it's just kind of as and when i find time i'm throwing these reviews up for you um with the tools that i own personally own personally buy none of these are sponsored um by anybody so if a tool's crap i'll tell you it's crap 
and if it's good I'll tell you it's good and this saw is good really good um, I've thoroughly enjoyed owning it and using it the lads like it um, it was one of my own lads that picked up on that the blade was a bit knackered and it was time to get a new one so I ordered one up from eBay I'll put a, a link on there for the blades as well yeah, I ordered one up from eBay I bought it it come in a couple of days uh, hats off to that seller and it, it took five minutes to put in and the lads are happy as Larry again because they've now got a saw to use again that's just like hot knife through butter so guys thank you very much hit the subscribe button uh, be much appreciated and it probably gives me a semi I want to see people hit that subscribe button uh, thank you very much and I'll see you again thank you